When I was 12, I had a trip to Crimea with my sister. We spent one month in the Black Sea without our parents. My sister is 10 years older than me, and at that time she was 22. She didn't pay much attention to my behavior there, and I was more or less free in my days. When we arrived in St. Petersburg and my mom met us on a platform, she was almost crying because of my completely different look. I was very, very skinny. During the months in Crimea, I ate only tomatoes, cottage cheese and coconut ice cream, which I like really much. I had an obsessive thoughts about my weight, and my idea was not to eat any bread, meat or anything that could gain my weight. After our back home, I had a short period of bulimia. Fortunately, it wasn't too long and I didn't have any problems with my health. But until now, the idea of controlling what I eat every day is really present in me. In 2019, I started my first year at the Academy of Fine Arts. It was a very complicated year, with a lot of stress and anxiety. The practice of taking pictures every day in case to control my diet was already a long time with me. Once, I posted on my Instagram a picture of my lunchbox. I still remember what was there. Tuna with rice, soft-boiled eggs, rucola and Greek olives. My friend, at that time living in Russia, asked me if I would like to share with her pictures of my daily meal in purpose to encourage her health habits. I agreed, and our so-called meal correspondence has been continuous already for two and a half years. Now I realized that it's not only about the food. It's about our friendship, self-care and support. We've been through a lot together and our relationship changed. We grew up and probably became less close but still kept our friendship. In the winter of 2021, when it was COVID and my anxiety was at its maximum level, these messages with food pictures helped me a lot. We were in touch with my friend. Every morning she asked me, Hi, how are you? What do you have for breakfast? Food is important. Breakfasts are important. We still send pictures to each other every day. For my last birthday, I got a beautiful plate from her. Now I serve my food on it.